Okay, it's really nice title, nice title. Alright, um... Oh. It's the main menu. Oh, and you can just go here, okay. Okay, um... I guess we just go to the alligator. It's Pat! No company. Please. Thank you. Um, yes, Sam. Wait. Um, no habla, hablo inglas, no habla espanol. Wait, what? No hablas at all, not even one hablo. Honestly, same dog. Hey, I'm trying to lay low here, so can you move, maybe move on? Please? Okay. Okay! You got me! I'll come clean! I'm sorry for being so rude before. I'm just a little... on edge. Normally, I wouldn't tell anyone this, but you've got such soulful... eyes. I can totally see the... entirety of... so I feel... Like I can see the... Inter entire it. Ah. So I feel safe with you, stranger. You see, usually I love coming to Johnny John jo John Johnny's on my birthday like this. It's his birthday. Staying in the hotel, floating in the pool, eating two bagels at the Continental breakfast, eating two wait what? Eating two soaps in the complimentary bath basket. But this year. I've got a problem. A real big problem. A real, real big uh-oh problem. The thing is, I'm pretty sure the family is finally trying to rub me out for squealing. I didn't mean to squeal, honest. I just see a pair of earnest eyes and the secrets just start flowing out of my snoot. My snoot, I say. See, I'm doing it right now. Oh. oh, cheese and crackers. What am I gonna do? I don't want to be rubbed out. Too tauntoony. Even told me I have to meet him upstairs here at 8 sharp for the quote unquote event. They think I don't know, but I heard him talking to Big Mama on the phone. The whole family is gonna come to really show me how it's done. What am I gonna do? I don't know, I don't, I don't wanna sleep with the fishes. I have a shellfish allergy and, and, and my asthma acts up when I get too waterlogged. Wait a sec, you're, in, you're, you're interested in me, right? Uh, you, you wanted to sit with me for breakfast and everything? Do you think you could help me? Since we're such great pals, you could go out and talk to my family around Alligator, New York City. Wait, what? Talk to my family and around. Is this the? Is this, is this alligator in New York City the place? I guess so. Find out information about the event and report back to me. Yes, this is a great idea. Together, maybe we can collect enough info to s s s s save me. You want to save me, right? Right. Great. I'll text you if I need any help. How about? Uh, you you uh, go go out there and start. Do you have a watch? Oh, I got a watch. Ah, you do. Great, great, great. I'll text a little before 10 a. Wait, uh, 10 a.m. Since I can take 15 minutes or so to get back here on the trolley. So make sure you watch. Make sure you check your watch a bunch. If you happen to get stuck doing some weird game-like activities while investigating. It could take time, time I don't have, because I'm going to have to, going to have a murder done on me. <laughs> oh, okay. Think of the beach, Pat. Remember what Dr. Dupal Snoop told you. Anyways, thank you so much for helping out an alligator like me. I really feel better just looking at your super kind and visible face. Be careful out there. The last thing we need is two people sleeping with the fishes. We need to find a double bed. 
we'd need to find a double bed in this economy? See you later, friend. Stay safe. Oh shit, who's this? Who's this wacky doodle? Hello, esteemed guest! If you're looking to leave the restaurant, you'll have to use the exit arrow up in the corner of the screen! Wow, wow, wow! We provide all our patrons with an exit arrow and a complimentary pillaments! Feel free to use both outside of our finest establishment to exit and munch as you wish! Just don't mix up, mix the two up since that tarot is vintage and known to contain harmful materials such as lead paint, asbestos, and a combination of rat poison and cilantro. Please flee, 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 feel free to visit us again here at John Johnny's and have a Johnny of a day. Cough. <coughs> uh, is there anything else I can do here? I talk to Pat again. See you later, friends. Stay safe. Okay, just check. What have I talked to? Welcome. Okay. Uh, I guess. I guess we head outside. Later, alligator. This week, hook and drag up and down. Oh. Wow. Can't wait to see that one. It's the Brodega. Oh, let's talk to this guy. It's Slick Nicky. Hey, bubs, you got a minute? Or perhaps three minutes? I ain't above asking for five. I saw you walking out of John Johnny's out there, and I said to myself, Nicky, you gotta talk to that mysterious stranger. A vision in Pine Strips. They is. I ain't trying to fluff you up or nothing, but you look like an alligator of exceptional. Wait, I'm an alligator? of exceptional taste, as well as one who might like to dabble in high-stakes games of chance and intrigue, if you feel me. No, don't actually feel me. I got a skin condition. They call me Slick for a reason. According to my doc, it ain't got any... It, it, it ain't going away unless the sun isn't that topical cream at night. But I ain't gonna listen to some jabroni with a uh, smartest certificate, you know what I'm saying? All my smarts come from the streets, which is also where I got the skin condition. And my impolite lower back tattoo. Oh. Oh. Boom. The name's Mickey. Mikey? Mickey? Mikey? Mickey? Mikey? Mikey? Mickey? Mikey? Mickey? Mickey? I'm going Mickey. Sure. But everyone calls me the old king of the gods. Well, that one guy did. Boy, he yelled at a fence to stop stealing his email passwords. Then his pants fell down. Then he fell down. Into an open manhole. But I have got good authority from the paramedics that he only called three or five other people that so bada bing. I'm gonna have to stay hydrated for this game, dog. My throat will. <laughs> this is too much talk for me. The old car king at his service. Oh! Alright, what about Pat? I talking about Pat, the alligator? Yeah, I know that dude pretty well. He's my second cousin. One time, when we was kids, us guys got locked out of CCD. CC, C, CCD. After recess, I miss juice and cookie time. We only had one granola bar between us, and good old Pat gave me the bigger half. Wow. Man, Pat's a real one. I'll always remember that. No, I ain't crying. I just, I just spit in my own eyes with a display of my street toughness. <laughs> You know about that, man, eh? Well, look here, bub. It's a real secret affair, you dig? Ain't nobody supposed to be going and telling Pat about it. My lips are sealed, just like they are sealed when I wake up after a night of nose-only breathing. Nice. Maybe, though. Maybe. Maybe. You play a little game with Mickey here. My lips might loosen up, you think? You can keep an eye on the flurry of thingies in the... Wait, what? You think you can keep an eye on this flurry of thingies and find the queen? 
Oh baby, we gotta see his fingies. I'll play. Mikey is running a street scam. Keep an eye on the queen and pick the correct car to foil his plants. Oh boy. Alright, get your paper. Peepa's peeled because his hand's about to become a hurricane. Oh boy. See here? Keep your eyes on the lady. On the lady. Alright. Where's she gonna go? Where's she gonna go? Holy fuck, dude. Where the frick did I go? Ah, it's gotta be a scam or something. Well, I guess we'll never know who won. Who knows which way the wind blows or some junk. Erp. That was a win? Ah, uh, was a win in my books. You got a family member badge. Oh, jeez. Anyways, about the event. Well, you yeah, ain't heard it from me, but I hear it's gonna be a real affair to remember. The whole family's talking about it for months. That's really gonna get his. If you know what I'm saying. Anyways, thanks for playing. Let me know if you need any of my city smarts while you're out there, rookie. Try not, try not to lick any trolley handrails if you can help it. Those dermatology copet cop pays are a real kick in the alligator pants, you feel me? Oh! Bow, 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 bow. The trolley ain't here yet, so why don't you go check out the arcade? Mickey got banned for his sick fingers gumming up the machines and causing an epidermis epidemic. But that ain't mean. But that ain't mean you gotta suffer the same fate. Oh, where is the arcade? Oh. Oh shit! It's my phone. Unknown. Um, hello? Is this by chance your first time in Alligator, New York City? I mean, in the city city? Not on um, Alligator, Long Island or something. It is. Who's this? It, I thought so. Oh, um, you don't know me. I'm sorry if, this, if that's weird. I just thought if you'd like this, I could text you some tips. The city's real big and has a lot of colorful secrets that I wouldn't want you to miss on your first visit. Is it okay if I help you out from time to time? Sure. Ah, great. I'll be sure to text you again soon. Don't forget to enjoy yourself. Alright. You got it. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'll talk to the the train player. Yeah, the train movie remake was passable. But if you ask me, nothing beats the parts of the original where a train leaps into the air and harnesses the holding the and the harness holding the actor breaks. And if you stay after the credits, you see the footage where he falls into the camera guy and a make is holding two coffins. Wow, crazy fact. It's Joni. Hey there. Okay, you know, you know, I want to say this is a female alligator, but I am not trying to do some crazy high-pitched voice right now. All right, all right, me. Can I um? Let me see if I can. Rock and Bonnie over to those twos are 
here every day, but you remember such a visible face like yours. Ah, oh, look at me being a real jerk. I don't mean to be giving you yeah, a hard time or nothing. I just, I just been a little frazzled since last night. I had a dream that I was a uh, ski ball and some sticky fingered kid kept throwing me into the 10 point hole. Go for the 50 dingus, I try to yell, but being a ball and all, ding dong couldn't hear me. I woke up in a cold sweat in my kitchen, systematically throwing individual oranges from the window into my neighbor's terrarium. The vitamin C would have helped me shake it off, but all I had for breakfast was a black coffee and a half a can of leftover candy cigarettes. Boom. The name's Joni, or Balona. Bal Balone? Baloney? Balona? If you're, if you're my fourth grade bully, come back to fight me. You're not, right? Sam? Anyway, I work here at Adelaide's Arcade, sweeping floors and keeping all the games from Smith as the babies bomb me behind. I used to work as a greaser in a shop downtown, but I left to be a closer to my gaming hobby. They let me keep the leather jacket and the company's hairstyle. That's my cousin, and also the most genuine dude I know, so you better be nice to him, you hear? I wouldn't want to have to pop you one. I told you, I, I, I'm told I got a mean left hook and moderately inside insulting right hook. And a kick that could benefit from some anger management courses. I tried to sign up for some calming hot yoga, but it didn't go over well. You, you, get, you ever get kicked by your own leg? It ain't great, but it ain't great. The event? Look, I know you're his spawn, for whatever reason, and that's fine. But I can tell you the family secrets, but I can't tell you the family secrets, you feel me? To give up that info, the, the, that, that hot, you'd, you'd have to really impress me. Alright. So what do you think? Can you roll the ball, Otama? I'm talking pinball. The old Penny B, as I like to call it against the advice of both my friends, family, and supportive therapist. I see on Thursdays. I got the high score on Lizard Wizards. Here eight months running, but I'm always looking for a real penny to pit my skills against. So what do you say? Care to take on a pinball lizard like me? I don't mean I make a joke, I, I take this very seriously. The old Penny B, I'll play, beat the score, go for more. Click the plunger, launch the pinball. When the ball is in play, control the flippers by clicking R and L, or use the left and right on your keyboard. Beat 5,000 points to earn Joni's respect. Let's -a go! Thirty minutes. Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What are you, are, are you saying that I'll take two? If I retry, I. I... Huh? My my time. Is this a time trial? On on the story? Like I don't know. I want to give it another try, but I don't want to spend thirty minutes. Whatever. I, I don't. I don't care. What, maybe I'll get the bad end. Alright, alright, we got this. I absolutely suck at this ball. Okay. I got super... Okay, that that's not even my fault, dude. The pinball is, like, rigged.
kid. I like your moxie. Forget what people say. The old penny B ain't about your high scores and winning. About a real feeling the spirit of the game. I got a family member badge. Oh, jeez. Now, maybe I'm just saying this to make you feel better because that the arcade soda I found was several years old. But the way you handled the flippers, it was like poetry. About the event, now this might just be a rumor, but word on the street there's gonna be some sick games there. Not pinball per se, but you know, you, you take what you can get. Anyway, that's all I can really say. I tried, I'd better get back on your grind, trying to be my last ice sport. Thanks for showing me your supple wrist pinhead. Cut shoot, catch you later. Uh, I guess I'll talk to Rock. Why do you always gotta come here? This place is a dump. You don't, you don't have to come, Rocco. No way. The only thing worse than being in a dump is not being invited to the dump to begin with. Like you're too trashy for other trash, which is unnerving close to an entry from my gym journal last week. Oh, that's it? Um, got the time, it's 9.30, I don't remember. What time was he gonna text me? I don't recall. Oh shit, there's more people out here. Hey bub, you're just in time. The trolley got here a minute ago. Wow, Poggos. Why don't you just go check out the city? Bring Mikey a hot dog. Oh, uh, maybe. Or some protective handwear. I'm gross. Oh. Oh, can I talk to these guys real quick? It's lovely Maria! Oh dear, I think I left my scrapbooking scissors at home by accident. Oh, I found my sister. It must have been your approach that gave me good luck, stranger. Hee <laughs> hee. I've been trying to get outside the home more since I had the new baby. Nana is watching her today, so here I am, out in the world. It's a little nerve-wracking to be away from the nursery after those months, to be honest. Ha 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 ha. I already miss all the new baby smells. Well, not all the smells. We all know more things come out of babies than just sweet fragrances of their cute little heads. Well, even that stuff is a little cute. <laughs> Boom. I'm Maria. It's wonderful to meet you. I was heading to the local YACA before I ran into you. I'm taking a class there today on scrapbooking, but I'm a little early. I mean to wait here in the lovely weather until the class on mom yoga and self-defense and eat, pray, shove. <laughs> Do you mean my son, Pat? Oh, I'm just so proud of him. It's his birthday today. Did you know he's so funny with how he treats himself to a hotel stay every year on the day? He just loves the continental breakfast and those free tiny soaps. I do get concerned. He eats too many of those. However, suds shouldn't be coming out of a snoot of a boy that age. The event is actually why I'm talking taking the class today. Oh. Actually, since you're one of Pat's friends, maybe you could help a mom out. You see, I'm trying to put together a family tree to bring tonight as a surprise, but I don't have everyone's pictures. It's so hard for all of us to get together in one place these days. I don't think anyone would like me to use their photos from early 2000s. We all made some questionable wardrobe decisions back then. Since you're already going around town, do you mind snapping some pictures of the family? Anyway, you get and bring back. I'll put them in the family tree. Oh, I see you already have one there. Would you like to put it in? Here, you can have mine as well. Don't forget about the pictures. Oh, these are the pictures? Nice. Let's see how much you've learned so far. Bop, 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 bop. Baba, oh, it's family history, mystery, family history, mystery. Um, okay, sure, I'll play, I guess. Click and drag the alligator's portraits into position of the family tree. Come back anytime to see your collection. Let's -a go. Oh shit, I don't know. Maybe that? No, no. How does this work? Over here. Over here. Is this game?
Oh, I got it. She's age 48, and she, she, her occupation is a church rummage sale cashier. Nice. And if these guys are cousins, then they could easily be here, 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 here. Oh fuck. Here, here, here. Oh. Here, 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 here. Eighteen, and he's annoying people. Nice. It sounds like Liam, am I right? And she's a pinball wizard. 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 Thanks again, dear. Come back anytime. The train's ready. Oh shit, I'm getting a text message from Pat. Hey, it's me, Pat. The alligator? The one with the hat? Hello, Pat. It's almost 10. Can you come back? The mouth. <laughs> Someone came over to my table and threatened me. Well, they gave me a coupon and told, told me to have a nice day. But that could mean anything! Exclamation mark, exclamation mark, exclamation mark, one, one. Free tomato soup or something like that. Uh, here's a coupon I got last week. If you come back, I'll give it to you. No questions asked. I'm on my way. Walking. Shit, this is cinematic. Oh shit, I took my glasses off. God damn. Why'd I take my glasses off? Who knows? Hey, don't don't bop me. Don't don't bop me. Oh, oh, it's just you, my new friend. Sorry, I saw your shadow over me. I thought some kind of restaurant assassin was descending from the raptors to take me out. And there's no raptors here, but assassins are tricky and they can improvise. Didn't you have to... Didn't you have... Dare when you were in elementary school? You know, dare. Dude, assassins really exist? At least I think that's the acronym. I was absent a lot due to my nut allergy. It was tough times for Pat at Willie's Peanut Butter Factory Element. What the? Peanut Butter Factory? Elementary school? Anyway, did you find out anything from the family? Well, yeah, I think they sound nice, but they might just be bluffing. Fluffing you up. You know, buttering your bread roll to throw you off the trail. Sorry, I've actually just been sitting here mainlining complimentary bread rolls the whole time you were gone. Maybe we should go to my hotel room. I think I feel a little safer there and less loggy with the bread. Let's go. Uh, this game is a hundred percent me. What does that mean? Is it a game? Find the code to Pat's abode, my safe place. Help Pat back into his hotel room, crossed out. Help Pat with his outdated website, crossed out. Help Pat remember his room code. That's the name of the game. Thanks for protecting me. It really helps to have someone walk me to my room. The wallpaper in here is a little intense. Kinda makes me feel like something's staring at me. I mean, like... They're just like weird, like, flowers or some shit. What am I gonna 
do? My heart can't take ten more hours of waiting. What's the event? What did I... Wh wh what did I squeal? The beans on. Cheese and crackers. Cheese and crackers. Since I was so worried about getting super murdered today, I did the smart thing and got a special lock from the hotel room door. Just a little something I picked up at the hardware store. I was worried I'd get nervous that I'd forget the lock's passcode, so I saved it on my website. www.alligator.fun I even made a button where you can click for it. Oh shit. This is Pat's homepage. Ah oh, shit, damn. What the actual... <laughs> Bro, what is that baby, dude? It be dancing. Shit. Warning. 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 Earth? Created by Geoskellies. Don't click. Pat only. Sorry. Under construction. Cutie. Life is a beach. Blingy. What the heck is this? About me. Welcome to my homepage. About me. I'm Pat. I'm Pat. We woo, we woo under construction. Uh. Alright, let's click on that. Don't click Pat only. If you're not Pat, you're breaking the law. This has been reported to your computer police. 91619. 91619 91619 91619 Oh Is your room, Pat? Hello, Pat. Oh, I think we found his room. Oh, here we are. This is for sure my room. You can tell by the unobstructive lock I installed. Can you go to my website and grab the code so we can unlock it? www.alligator.fun. I really want to go inside and see if there's any more of those free mints left. not it try again okay uh what was it again uh was it 91619 you did it thank you so much what the Whoa. i can't close it what's going on no, you gotta help me. I don't even like pink. What, what, what do I do? Nine, one, six, six. Oh. That's getting on my feet. Just enter any. Well, I did enter anything. What do you mean? Nine, one, six, seven, nine. Oh my gosh. What the heck was that? There's a hole. Is that a hole? Did it. Tim, hello, my word. This is quite the mess. Who are you two? Why have you opened my door? Huh? Who am I? I'm Pat, and this is my hotel room. I saw this lock because my family is trying to rub me out. But this is my door, where I installed the lock because my family is trying to rub me out. But if that's true, and my password still works, is your lock code 91619? Is your lock code 91619? We have the same code! And our families are both trying to kill us? <laughs> so long, stranger. Perhaps in another life, we could have been total best friends. Like, like ships in the night, Mr. Bat. Anyway, don't tell anyone what you've seen here, or I'll come for you endlessly. <laughs> 
That sure was a string of unlikely coincidences, wasn't it? <laughs> I hope that guy's room is okay. That stuff kind of smelled. Don't tell me that's your room. What do you mean this is your room? How'd you get it confused, dog? <laughs> this is my actual room. They are so similar, no wonder I mixed them up. Thanks, I never would have remembered that on my own. Come on in. Wow, I beat the game. Phew. I'm so glad we made it inside. Now I really can... I can really try to relax a little. Sorry to distract you from the investigation. I'll text you again when it gets closer to 4 p.m., so don't forget to check your watch. You know, in case you get distracted doing a collection of menial tasks formatted in an enjoyable manner, something like that, um, you got a family to move back. Oh, jeez. Bye for now. Charlene. That's uh, there's something uh, so nice about just sitting by yourself in a restaurant with a good book. My girlfriend is coming to pick me up after work. I'm so nervous. Well, I guess we'll talk to this snazzy Daryl. You ever eat at John Johnny's here? The food's alright, but... That bottomless chowder bowl was a disaster. I picked that thing up and bam, chowder pants the rest of the day. <laughs> Ain't nobody can follow these ferocious thingies. Uh... Oh, I got a puzzle or something? Oh shit, it's a Brodega. Brodega. Oh shit, who did? It's Fifth William the Fourth. Oh boy, that sign flower looks as tasty as ever. I came. I got me on most days as well. Uh, but I usually leave when someone calls the alligator police or I slip and fall down in rather overworked fashion. True. Oh, let's look at the flower. It's a it's a puzzle piece or something. Ooh. Wow 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 wow. Back in the arcade for a quick second, of mid jiggers. Uh, another puzzle piece. Yeah, I don't know what those are. Oh, another puzzle piece. My mom is always on my case. Like, Artie, go outside and talk to other alligators. Oh, Artie, stop hiding behind various types of curtains and in and outside our home. Oh shit, I can go anywhere. Where am I? Um, um, where am I right now? Oh, okay, whatever. Let's go to uh, downtown. Oh boy, look at this. Wow. Look at everyone. Everyone looks so friendly. Can I talk to them? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey again, your friendly city guide here. So I was wondering, have you been finding any puzzle pieces around? I have. I thought so. You can have a lot of fun, you can, you can find a lot of fun things you might expect in the city by clicking around. Puzzle pieces, secret baubles to look at, interestingly shaped sewer rats. It's a real mena ma. I don't know how to say the word. Maybe if you find enough pieces, you'll be able to do something good with them. 
like unlock something or make a small blanket for a family of chili 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 squirrels like they're cold ah the world is so bright have lots of fun looking around all right thanks for that i sell books oh puzzle piece puzzle piece Mini, 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 mo. I will talk to Emo Mona, the sniper. The snipper? Are you hear about joining the resistance? Come to the front door, but don't let the feds tell you the password is the only thing worth fighting for. Fighting for. Justice, absolute. Which is also the name of my favorite Mark's learning ska band. Yes, I said favorite. There are more than one. There are, there are more than one. Okay. Oh shit. There are two as a matter of fact. The first single is about putting a potato on the tailpipe of a crooked alligator governor when he tried to join the mailing list. No GMOs. That's no governors, they opt in. Who? I'm Mona, but you can call me by my online handle for safety, which is K-Pop Angel 85! <laughs> no! No! Wow! <laughs> My guy just said gave up Besides the cause. Pat. Do you mean Hat Pat or do you mean Bat Pat? No, 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 you probably mean Hat Pat. Bat Pat is my high school neighbor that used to pick me up for DSA meetings on Friday until he got grounded. He'd apparently broken his night nay nays favorite set of extremely fragile, large eyed porcelain deer with something. A club? Hmm. Well, it's not important. We'll spring him eventually. Yes, Dad. I mean, legally. Anyway, Hat Pat is an okay dude. I barely know the guy, but he still made me punch a punch, made me a punch-proof vest to wear a protest out of Doctor Soda bottle caps. He's a stand-up alley gator, ally gator, ally, ally. He maybe drinks too much soda though. Doesn't he know that government puts in that stuff? I tell you, but the CIA agent that watches my cell phone probably delete my chumbler. Chumbler? In vengeance. That's where I keep all my pictures of day one. Who the frig is day one? Which? I have four events to go to this week alone. Like tomorrow it's minstroni. Monday. At the soup kitchen. Then it's Taco Tuesday at the women's shelters. Wednesday doesn't have a funny name, but everyone does get those cupcakes with the white squiggles as an extra at the alligator food pack. If you're talking about tonight though, you might as well go act like a cop somewhere else at the Sapine Stripes. I don't rat on my comrades. My mind is bolted up so tight that Count of Monte Cristo has spent years trying to escape from me while I was plotting his revenge against those who wronged him. We just finished reading that book in my Tuesday Lit class. Pretty baller to be TBH. I love revenge and breakfast. Listen, I'm not trying to give you quite a pad or something. I'm just a little stressed out. Not to go all first word, not, not, not to go all first world probs on you. 
Bobs. But I have Zyme due to be scanned by tomorrow afternoon. If I miss the deadline, it won't get printed in time for the Indie Comics slash Annual People with Bangs convention this weekend. Do you know how long it takes to staple a stack of designs? At least two full episodes of listening to Gator Crater, a true crime podcast about the world's most blown up alligators. Yes, Dad, I also have Algebra 2 homework. If you could help me out put some of these pictures together, maybe I could give you the straight dope about that dope. So you ready to join the resistance? All right, I'll play, why not? Mona Zai needs to cover these, cover three tropics, why can't I read? Mona Zines need to cover three topics evenly. Choose a clip to add to the design, then click the page to glue it in place. Be careful, some clips cover two topics at once. So check it, page stripes. I've already done all the hard, hard design stuff, like picking the clips and cutting everything with semi-straight lines. I need to pick a good selection of them, then glue them into place. But sadly, ever since the thickening of 2017, I'm not allowed to use glue myself, or glue sticks, or rubber cement, or large stickers, or small stickers, so you're gonna have to be the hero at Sticks to Picks. This design encompasses, of course, the three most important, most signy things possible. I'm talking about the social issues, indie comics, and K and, and K-pop, obviously! These three topics go together like peanut butter jelly. Peanut butter jelly and a third comparable thing that escapes me in this moment. But that doesn't mean we can lean into and in, in need one blah blah. My design has to be balanced. Or people will think I'm biased. That means no page space or any one thing more than the other. So pick up a pick and get ready to stick. Carefully though. I have limited selection of content, and glue is forever. Just ask my hands. R.I.P. and Valhalla, Poopy the Third, 2015 to 2017. When you're done, we'll ask the editor if it's ready to scan. So get pasting. Get ready. The cover is really important. It has to portray the essence of what's going on inside. It's sort of like choosing what's ironically humorous t-shirt to spur at the Rosh Hashanah that'll really unsettle your extended family. Uh, okay, so we can do um, this one that kind of looks like it's like um, the k pop one. This one looks like the uh, like, uh, exposing uh, man. This one, this one's, uh, you know what, you, you know, you already know me, you know, we gotta go for what's, 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 what's the real, what, what, you, yep, that's what we're going, really not happy how the text covers up day one here, but we all must make sacrifice due to the cause, damn, day one's hair, got covered by the sticker, but you gotta do what you gotta do, and due to the limitations of picture shop BS3, Alright, don't forget to balance the topics. I wouldn't want anyone to accuse me of political bias or standing bias. Standing bias. Uh, together forever. I actually made this one myself. No one watches the Xerox machine in the school library at lunch. I'm on tater tot. Do, 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 do. What is this one? Is it like a comic or something? LOL, I'm going to send this one to everyone I know. And some people I don't. If you type random numbers into your phone, they have to go somewhere, right? Do we really want someone who eats a sad lunch for another term in office? Why don't more boys wear eyeliner? And everyone can benefit from having the mysterious allure of a perfect wingtip. Uh, uh, I guess. Facts. I didn't 
win the Zion Award at last year's con, but I placed third in the Cool Bangs. Not gonna lie, kinda like this. We got Kyung Tae, Day 1, Joshua Ransom, COL, X Top, Jung Nam, Mr. Mian, Mian, Mian Man. And I don't know if this guy's name is just 10.6 or something. But yeah, Tiny Day 1. Sorry, I just got him all over puberty sweat. And the distinct need to buy cutified products. The last inside page is the hard hitter. You have to really leave them wanting more. Like actually really, actually more like, maybe they'll give you a couple more bucks to pick up a few of their comrades. Uh, we got the concert. We got, uh, this is Luis. She feels the Wibbly Finn is an inadequate mayor. Balance the budget. He can't even balance on this log in his own yard, no less. Obviously, we do the K-pop concert. I actually have this poster. My, my sister Lizzie helped me put it on my bedroom ceiling. Damn, that's crazy. And then, um... Kiss Sandra! Every beat of my heart, I long for you. Douglas, I am very stoic and don't like anyone because of my tragic past. But you, Cassandra, have broken through my harsh, scaly exterior and changed me with your extremely quirky personality, inability to cook, and unusually beautiful singing voice. I like this. Let's put it on. This one's a last minute submission from my friend and cousin's Nina. You can read the rest on our blog. It got a call the Tour de Force by someone whose Twitter icon was the best ship from a popular TV show. We're almost there. Just paste on the back cover and we'll be all done. Okay, so we got Mayor Wibbly Finn would make a terrible addition to the K-pop group, eight guys, and Therefore, we should examine the type of polit politician we really want to hold in office in our beloved city. As you can see in this photo, he just doesn't fit, and therefore the case is made that all he is is out of touch despite his effort to not look out of touch and looks gross here in this photo. Then we have like this, uh, this picture where they're sleeping, and they get like their phones vibrating, and then they like they become like K-pop superstars or something. Uh, that's just... I think we'll do this. This one makes a really solid case, I feel. We're all done. Hand it over. I said fair and balanced, but you're clearly favoring one topic over the others. I should have known that. I lost? <laughs> I didn't think this was. I thought this was just for funsies. <laughs> Suck it too. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Maybe less K-pop. Less K-pop. Uh, I gotta give uh, everyone a chance. Give give everyone a chance. Get ready. I think we're gonna do uh, this one. Balance the topics, balance the topics. B. Okay. C. Two K-pop, two two uh two mayor things. 
are both just mayor things, but okay, so I, I'll just do one there. And then do a cape. What is this one? We all... I can't read this shit. Final season something. Please, please tell me it was good. Please. Ah, uh, what do you mean? What do you mean? Mona. <laughs> Mona, what do you mean? Bruh, I can't be wasting 30 minutes at a time on this shit. Again, I don't know what how to say. Okay, the cover it's comics. What? Oh, okay. So okay, it's uh, comics. Okay. B. So next, next up, we're gonna do politics. Which I've done each time, so politics it is. And then we do comics. Comics we got. This is very similar to what I did the first time. And then we do K-pop. I did not do this one. I did not put the K-pop on. Or did I? I might have. Let me do K-pop again because it's only two options it seems. But I'll do this one because I like this one more. And then this one's going to be uh, uh, politics. Uh, let's do this one. And then after politics we do more politics. And then we do the K-pop comic. Alright, alright, come on, come on, come on. <gasps> yes, this is perfect, you can see her eyes, oh my god! Wow, Mona looks way better without the bangs covering her entire eye balls. Yes, this is perfect. Let's show it to the editor for approval. Dad? Look, huh? Yeah, uh, sure. Whatever. World's dad is smug. <gasps> Looks like we're all set to scan and send to the printers. Let's go! Each page is balanced and checked and earned my respect. Copyright. <laughs> Let's go! Oh, I got the dad too. Let's go. That's a pretty rad tagline. If I had a public access channel talk show, which is 100% in the cards, by the way, if I keep up a B plus second, second term, um, that would definitely be my sassy cash phrase. Anyways, the event is gross. It's a gross allocation of funds if you want my opinion. And did you know helium is a finite resource? Seriously, Ali, Google it. Every balloon at the shindig is basically a big heck off to the folks that really need it, like scientists and clowns that are down on their luck but have a hopeful heart. I'll see you here tonight, comrade. Bring your favorite safety pin covered jean, jean vest for a righteous popping. Yo, Mona's 
edgy. Um, let's go talk to Papuli. Bugs, bugs for sale. More than one, even unlike what the sign implies. Yeah, I sell bugs here. No, not for baiting, but eating. We're alligators and we eat bugs. You're just something you know because you exist here canonically. Anyway, get bug buying or good buying. Kiddo, I ain't got all day. Cause I gotta sell bugs to feed my family with different bugs, which is a bug with an alligator currency. Boom. Most people call me Papole, but my real name is Mortimer Glyze Jr. The third and a half. On account of my grandfather being perfectly bisected by a wheat thresher during the Great Depression. Miraculously he survived, but his life wasn't without his problems, such as how it was hard to see him when he turned directly to the side. Gampa, where are you? We'd call a Tanua veil. You already slipped through the crack in the direct de decorative linoleum. It's last time we have a sign. And also, when those basement sounds started up, but look at me rambling here to a youth about cellar schemes and like. You know Pat? Yeah, did you say Pat? That's my grandson's name. But also the name of the nurse that comes to massage the king side of my, na of my tail on Tuesdays. Did you mean Pat? Well, it's Pat. Do I have to speak up? I'm hard of hearing due to a condition where I stop listening mid-sentence and think about the war. Damn. Yeah, but then, I'm not quite sure what you're talking about. I have selective memory disorder, you see, and that I forget about things I really don't want to go to. Damn, me too, dude. Perhaps you could jog this old man's memory if you help me with a favor. You see, the only photo I have left of my dear late wife, Mata, was I uh, has been a, a victim of the wheat thresher incident. I can't seem to put it back together again. Oh, how I'd give anything to see Mata's sweet smile again. Care to help this old softy gaze upon his lost love once more? I got you, dog. Took a block who slided into an empty space. Resemble the picture to gaze upon this alligator's beautiful wife. What the fuck? It looks like you're not very good at this. Solve, keep sliding. I'm gonna keep sliding. Uh, <laughs> I'll show you, game. I'll show you all. Uh, uh, uh. We're getting there, we're getting there. Seeing stuff, I'm seeing stuff.
off? Why does it keep bringing it back up? Like, no, I'm gonna get this. Like, relax, I'm good. I did it without having to get it solved. I am God Gamer. That's it. That's my Martha. Oh, lovely dear Martha. I always remember the sound of a sweet voice in her. Whoa. Oh shit, you freaking. Oh dear, it seems you must have seen the other side now. With my secret way. What? Shh. You have a secret? Could you put this one back together too? If not for me, then for the creepy old coop grandpas everywhere?
something here. We're doing something. We're kind of cracked at this. We are absolutely cracked. One by myself. Got a family member badge. Oh, Gertie, good old Gertie. That's the that's been years since I looked upon you, sweet curly hair, and your man breaking arms. Thank you so much for your help, stranger. Thanks to you, I'm being out of a boast. My last love, not the past ten years ago, but Gertie is just in witness protection. You know, from all the man breaking. What a firecracker that gal. On cold days, I could still feel the phantom broken body pain she left me. The uh, event? Oh, you mean tonight's event? Well, I can tell you, it's on past my bedtime. You young folk love staying up late. Me and my bed by six, nine, nightly. After a modest dinner of soft bug puddings and four to seven episodes of soft flutes on public broadcast. Anyway, kiddo, thanks again. Or helping me out, or should I say, helping three out? Heh, <laughs> don't tell my grandkids. <laughs> oh, it's already a love, dude. God damn, dude. God damn. Uh, yeah. Finish 
shall last. Sorry, this this crazy kooky game, which I'm kind of really vibing with. Um, loving the alligators, loving the aesthetic. Everything's fun, fun, fun. Uh, puzzles are pretty solid. Honestly, solid game I randomly found while I was browsing the, the Steam shop. And uh, we'll pick it up another day. Probably beat it eventually. It's, I don't think it's that long of a game, but uh, yeah, that's the, that's the end of the stream. Marinos, peace out, dog.